only hear from. Your past is a gift. All right, so in this video, I wanted to talk about something that I've heard. It's an old expression. And for so, I don't know if it was in a song or on the radio. I just heard someone talking and they came up with that expression again. Time heals all wounds. Time heals all wounds. Okay, so I want you, after all the videos we've been through, okay, because there's 300 plus videos here on this channel, after all the videos we've been through, really, is it time that heals all wounds? Is it time? Or is it you? Because in any given moment that you have an experience, you can decide in that moment to resolve it. If you're present, if you're living in the present moment, each moment is precious to you and you don't want to miss a thing, you resolve it in that moment. If someone said something unkind, said something hurtful and you feel that you can't let it slide, that it's something that you have to address in that moment, then address it in that moment and then let it go. Don't carry it for years and years and years and hold on to it. All these grudges that we hold on to, all this anger against other people because we can't forgive. So wounds aren't healed by time. They're healed by you when you're ready. And sometimes it can take people 20, 30 years to get over something. And then by some miracle, they decide, okay, I'm going to let that go now. Okay? Now, if you've been following these videos at all, you would understand that we are all human beings and that we are all going through this life. Okay? We all have our experiences and we're not all going to interact with the world in the same way because of the experiences we've had. And when someone hurts someone else, it's because of a pain that they're carrying inside. Once this is clear to you from all the videos that have been created here, once that is absolutely clear to you, that nobody can hurt another person unless they are in pain, to start with. There is some pain, some degree, something hurting inside within them that they're not good enough, that they're not worthy, that they don't deserve. And then they're passing that on to someone else. They're trying to make others feel that way because that's how they feel inside. When you're in that place, then you can address each moment and understand, okay, I didn't like what you did, you can see the human being in it, okay, what they're going through, the pain that they they must be suffering to do that, whatever it is, whatever the action or words. You can let it go and you can forgive it in that moment. It always, it's always been up to you. It's got nothing to do with time. 10 years is not going to heal a divorce. 20 years is not going to heal a divorce. You heal it. You heal it because I have seen people that have been separated forever <laughs> I'm talking 10 20 30 years and there's still this resentment there's still so much going on that they just can't let go of that they just can't forgive so time does not heal it I'm sorry but it just doesn't you do you are the only one that can heal anything in any given moment. You, yourself, not time. Now, when it comes to losing someone because they've passed away, it's all right for you to miss them. Time is not going to heal that either. You're always going to miss them because you loved them. You wanted to share your life with this person. If it's a child that you've lost, God forbid, you know, but if it's a child, a daughter or a son, there's no way you're going to have one day in your life that you're not going to miss them. Time is not going to change that. When your parents go, if you had parents that loved you, that you love with all your heart, when they die, there won't be a day that goes past that you won't miss them. 
And that's okay. You know, because they haven't been here for 10 years doesn't mean you're going to miss them any less than if they've been gone for a week. They were a big part of your life. You loved them. They loved you. Time will not change that. And there's nothing wrong with you missing them because they were so beautiful in your life. They meant so much to you in your life. There's nothing wrong with you missing them. That you may cry less, you know? I mean, if you believe, like I believe, that you will be reunited when it's your time to go, there's really not much to grieve because you know that soon you'll be together again. What to us might seem like 50 years, on the other side is a blink of an eye. That's what I believe. Everyone's different. But if you believe that, yes, you can be upset when it, you know, when it happens and you can miss them terribly, but soon you'll be together. You're never really, really apart from each other. You can't see them, you can't hug them, you can't kiss them, you can't, you can still tell them that you love them. They can still hear you but they're not right in front of you for you to be able to share all that with them anymore. You can't create any new memories with them now that they're gone. But time will not change that. It will not make that. It will not make you miss them any less. And so, you know, it's not gonna make that pain go away if you like. So to me, in my mind, time doesn't fix anything. I haven't seen it fix anything. That we have a dimmer memory of it, you know, because, okay, 20 years have passed, so the memory's not as sharp as when it happened. Meh, maybe. You know? But only you can heal it. Only you can heal the wounds. And it can be today. Doesn't matter if it's something you've been holding on to for 10 years, 20 years, 50 years. If there's a grudge, if there's an anger, if there's something that makes you incredibly sad, you can heal it today in this very moment. You don't have to hold on to it any longer. You don't. Only you can heal it when you want to when you're ready to. All right, my darlings? I love you guys. Remember to click like and subscribe below so you don't miss any of the messages. And I'll see you in the next video. Bye for now.